Hello YouTube, welcome to Bub's World. I'm your host Bub. Today we're just gonna do one book, a one book unboxing. Uh, we're gonna test out some of this new equipment we're working with today, so uh, leave a comment below, tell me what you think. Uh, so without further ado, let's see what I got. You're watching Bub's Comics, Bub. All right, well I got a Batman key today. Super excited. Uh, this right here is a book I've wanted for quite some time. I was waiting to get it because I wanted the price to be just right where it is. I, it's just kind of how I am. I was looking for this book in a 2.5 and I wanted it for under 100 bucks. Well, it finally happened. The book became available for that and it was, uh, the guy wanted $99. <laughs> he wanted $99 for it. So I sent him a message like, hey, you know, whatever. I, I sent him an offer. I said, or best offer. So I sent an offer for, uh, I sent it for 75, I think. And I was hoping to get it somewhere in between. Came back with uh, $5 less. So it became $94. And at that point, I just wanted to get something off. So I went ahead and pulled the trigger. And with it, I got this Batman number 411. It's actually a Tech 411. So Tech Comics 411 with the first appearance of Talia Al Ghul. Check that out. And you guys know I'm into some good Batman art. You know that I enjoy a little bit of bondage. So look at this. Just a great combination. A book like this belongs in my collection. Super cool. Tech Comics 411. It says, Into the Den of the Death Dealers. So, uh, now I personally really enjoy Talia Al Ghul. I think that this is one of the better uh, relationships for Batman. I, as the kids used to say, I ship them. I ship Talia Al Ghul on Batman, and it gave rise to one of the great uh, Robins, I think. After Dick Grayson, I like uh, Damian Wayne as Robin. So being able to get a Damian Wayne out of the two of these getting together is pretty awesome. A true son of Batman, but raised by Ra's al Ghul in the League of Assassins. That's good stuff. That's just good writing, good storytelling. And uh, there have been some great issues with Damian Wayne, some not so much. But uh, typically, it's a character that people do well with. I feel like writing, it's an interesting character. And I think that that's one of the marks of a good character is when you have someone that multiple different writers can write with and still have a good time and tell a new and an exciting story. And I think they do a good job with that with Damian Wayne. So getting Talia Al Ghul and Batman together was necessary for getting Damian Wayne. So here we are. We'll take another look at it. Tech 411, Batman and Batgirl. And here's the uh, back cover if you care about such things. This is being presented in a Gator Guard case. Never mind that I put it in the case upside down. Uh, sometimes things like that happen in Bugs World. So <laughs> we were in a hurry. So anyway, that's my one book haul. I hope you all enjoyed that. We'll catch you next time in Bugs World. Remember to read a comic and don't apologize for the glare. Bye-bye. Now subscribe, you egg-sucking pieces of gutter trash. Now.